Introduction Rahul was a very untidy boy. He left his clothes, books, shoes and toys scattered all over the room. His mother was tired of putting his room in order. One day she decided to leave Rahul's room as it was. Rahul returned from school and accidentally stepped on a banana peel he had forgotten to throw in the dustbin in the morning. He slipped and fell and hurt his back. Thankfully, the injury was not serious. However, this incident changed him. He now keeps his room neat and tidy. In this lesson, you will learn about good habits. Objectives at the end of this lesson, you'll be able to Define daily routine Explain the importance of exercise and playing List good eating and sleeping habits Explain how to take care of belongings Daily routine We do certain activities every day. Such activities form our daily routine. Let us now list your daily routine. Every day you Brush your teeth, bathe, comb your hair, wear clean clothes, eat breakfast, go to school, study and play at school, return home in the afternoon, eat lunch, do your homework, go out and play with friends, return home and study, watch TV. Eat dinner with family. Sleep. Exercise. Our daily routine must also include exercises so that we remain active and healthy. Jogging, running, cycling, swimming, etc. are excellent forms of exercise. An exercise strengthens our muscles, keeps us active, protects us from diseases. Healthy playing habits. Playing is a very good mental and physical exercise. Outdoor games exercise our muscles and make them strong. They also teach us planning and cooperation. Indoor games exercise and sharpen our minds. Certain precautions must be exercised while playing. We must never play on roads. We must not destroy property while playing. We must not fight while playing. We must play in open grounds. We must develop sportsman spirit. Healthy food habits. Besides exercising, we must also watch what we eat. We must eat a balanced and nutritious diet that includes cereals, pulses, vegetables and fruits. It is not enough to eat right food. It is important to eat it at the right time and in the right manner. We should not skip any meal. We should eat all our meals at a fixed time. We should chew our food properly and not eat in a hurry. We should neither eat less nor eat more. Eating less leads to undernourishment while overeating leads to obesity. Good Habits at Home Apart from playing, exercising and developing good food and eating habits, we should maintain personal and domestic hygiene by bathing every day, washing and combing our hair, wearing washed and ironed clothes, throwing garbage in garbage bins. Good personal and domestic hygiene keeps us fit. Care of Belongings Another good habit that we must all develop is to take care of our belongings. We should not leave our belongings scattered. Always put them back in their places. Arrange our books in the shelves neatly. Place our shoes in shoe racks. Keep washed clothes in wardrobes. Healthy sleeping habits. A good night's sleep is as important as any exercise to stay active and fit. Sleep rests and refreshes our mind and body.
To get a sound sleep of eight hours and wake up refreshed, use a mattress that is neither too soft nor too hard. Use a pillow. Keep the bedroom clean. Use soothing lights. Self-assessment. It is time to check your knowledge. Look at the given images. They represent activities that are performed by us every day. Arrange them in correct sequence by dragging them into the numbered boxes. Pure air. Air is a mixture of gases. Oxygen contained in air is important for the survival of living things. Air is polluted by smoke from vehicles and industries. Breathing polluted air can lead to asthma, bronchitis, etc. We can solve the problem by planting more trees. Trees purify air by absorbing the carbon dioxide in them and giving out oxygen. Pure water. Water is also an important natural resource. It is necessary for the survival of plants, animals and human beings. Fertilizers wasted from industries and washing clothes and animals in the rivers pollute water. Drinking dirty water can cause many diseases like jaundice, typhoid, etc. Therefore, we must filter to purify water. Water is a scarce resource. We must not waste it while brushing, bathing and washing. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. Activities that we do every day form our daily routine. Playing and exercising keep us mentally and physically fit and active. We must develop good eating habits. We must maintain personal and domestic hygiene to lead a healthy life. We must take care of our belongings. A sound sleep of 8 hours refreshes our mind and body.